diversity in Hollywood. <laughs> the unfortunate thing is like it's 2019 and we're still talking about diversity. Um, the beautiful thing is, you know, you see a, a, a movie like Black Panther and it did a billion. And it's always when people say like, there's a word, one of, one of the words I, 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 I hate is minority. Because when you say I'm a minority, that is a self-defeatist mentality. You're not a minority. And it's just like, you have to think that it, it can be done. And when they say, well, black movies don't sell, because that's been always a, well, black movies don't sell. Well, black TV shows don't sell. And it's like, oh, we did a billion worldwide. You know, Empire is probably the biggest show in Africa. You know what I'm saying? You go there and it's just like, oh, you know, so they're watching these movies, Get Out did numbers. Anytime you go and see an August Wilson play or, or one of the plays from African-Americans, it's like, it's probably the most sold out for the theater. You know, so we can't say that this stuff doesn't sell because we've, I've grown, I, I grew up watching all the shows on television and you're just like, okay, I don't see any representations, you know, of me. And, and I think the great thing about entertainment or edutainment as KRS one coin, it's just, you get another slice of life and we can't keep, you know, 20,000 cop shows, it's 20,000 hospital shows. It's like, let's see something different, man. And I think a lot of actors and, and directors and producers are getting more power and, and, and combining their talents and saying, yo, there is a market for us. There's an audience for us. You know, we don't believe that we do not sell in, in uh, cause somebody's watching it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I remember this question when Barack got, you know, nominated, you know, for president or whatever it is. And it was like, well, Hollywood's gonna change. And it's like, no, it's not. Why would it? They don't have to change. And we got to stop asking other people to tell our stories. We have enough millionaires. We have billionaires now. They can combine if Jay-Z, Diddy, Oprah, Tyler, all these people, all these football players and boxers, all the money they got. If they say, all right, let's 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 do a, a DreamWorks. You know, let's let's do the model out the DreamWorks. Then we stop going and asking people, please tell my story. It's worthy. You know, we have to tell our own stories. There's black billionaires in Africa, man, Nigeria. And they, I mean, I just produced a, a TV show in Uganda. You know, that we're, we're sending over to Netflix Africa now. And these are very talented brothers and sisters, you know, very talented brothers and sisters with great stories. The stories I couldn't write down enough. I was just like, wait, 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 what, what was that story? What was the name of this, uh, this, this, this leader or this king or this, you know, the stories about Haile Selassie and, and stories about Idi Amin. And you're just like, oh, wait, wait, you know, uh, stories about the genocide. You're just like, wait, let me, you know, so we have to bridge you know, like I go to, I go to Africa, I've been to 16 countries now, and I go like two, three times a year now. African-Americans and Africans need to connect. You know, we need to go back and build because they're, it's, it's, the resources are rich, the people are beautiful, and everything we hear about Africa is totally wrong, <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's like there, we gotta do this collaboration and start collaborating more. And you can find a way. There's one soundstage in all of Africa and that's Cape Town. We like, let's put a soundstage in East, East Africa. They're shooting movies there. Why not? We gotta stop thinking as beggars and start be like, hey man, let's get our own stuff. Cause if you're coming to someone saying, please help me, they, they don't have to help you. I don't have to fund the movie on your culture, why, why, why do I have to? Why do I want to tell that story? And we have to understand it's show business, you know? That's great, you got the art, but how much money can I make off this story? How much money, who's the actor in here? Who's gonna bring, who's gonna put people in seats? That's the bottom line now, the bottom line is green. How can we make money? I mean, diversity is great, and hopefully it continues in that direction, you know? And I, I think there is a, I think Hollywood got it. Black Panther really opened some eyes. It did a, <laughs> it did numbers. So it's like, oh, Black Panther 2, greenlit, let's do it, you know? So um, 
Hopefully it continues in the right direction.